For hardcore fans of comic books, animes, and superheroes, cosplay is a sacred art form that involves a lot of passion, creativity, and attention to detail, not to mention some serious bucks. For serious cosplayers, it's not just about paying homage, but truly embodying their beloved characters. That's why they go through such great lengths to make their transformations as believable as possible. Prepare to be mind blown by these 10 costumes that take cosplay to the next level. What's up, Vacnatics? This is Discovery Amuse, serving up your daily dose of the most outrageous, outlandish, and out of this world fun facts. While all of our picks are seriously impressive, our number one pick will put your friendly neighborhood Spidey's humdrum costume to shame. Time to hit the runway with these show-stopping suits. Number 10, Resident Evil. Grotesque would probably be the best word to describe this first costume on our list. Freaky comes a close second. In case you need a little refresher, Dr. William Birkin is the chief scientist of the Umbrella Corporation and one of the main antagonists in the Resident Evil franchise. In his final moments, he injects himself with the G-Virus, which causes him to mutate into a monster known as G. And here, ladies and gentlemen, is a Japanese artist named Guy who perfectly captured the character's mutated form, complete with the moving claws and giant eyeball that could surely make kids, or even adults, pee in their pants. And look at that head. It's not Guy's, but also part of the costume. Even the skin looks disgustingly on point. It makes my own skin crawl. If that's not devotion, I don't know what is. But hold your horses because we're just getting started. Our number one entry might just give you nightmares. Number nine, Hulkbuster. Marvel superheroes are a staple in any Comic Con, but in rare occasions, a Marvel cosplayer comes along that just makes everyone else look like wimpy amateurs. Just like this Hulkbuster costume spotted at the 2015 New York Comic Con. The Mark 44 armor is the heavy duty exoskeleton designed by Tony Stark, AKA Iron Man, to fight Bruce Banner's alter ego, the Hulk. As the name implies, this armor is big enough to be able to handle the incredible green guy during his mood swings. So it's no surprise that it caught the eyes of everyone when cosplayer Thomas De Petrillo showed up in this realistic suit that looked straight out of the movie. De Petrillo is no stranger to elaborate costumes such as this one, as he is part of the cosplay building team called Extreme Costumes. I do this because I love it, because I love making things, I love a chance to express my creative side, and I love a chance to interact with people while I'm in costume. I love the performing side as well. I love being that character for a little while. The chunky build of the red and gold protective gear brought the nine and a half foot tall costume to about a hundred pounds, which is quite a weight to bear. Hey! Oh, and it also took 1600 hours to build. No biggie. The armor is also equipped with speakers and a microphone that enable it to make huge crashing sounds with every step. That ought to put the newbies to sleep. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. Number eight, Super Metroid. Now this one might not be the most expensive costume out there, but it's certainly one of the most ingenious. Dan Cattell, the artist behind this pixelated two-dimensional silver space pirate from the game Super Metroid, took the internet by storm when photos of his one-of-a-kind costume went viral. It did not require so many moving pieces and elaborate armor and props, but it turned heads because of its unique concept. Even more impressive is the fact that the entire thing is hand-painted. Yes, the costume only looks cool from a particular angle, but Dan's amazing puppetry skills sells it. In computer animation, your job usually is to make something that's digital look as real as possible. So I kind of did the inverse of that by making a practical effect look digital. 
If you look past the pixels, you'll see Dan wearing a black bodysuit and trying his best to embody the character by mimicking all its moves. Because this costume was such a hit, he followed it up with a pixelated design of another Metroid character named Samus, which earned him an interview call from Nintendo Power. He's surely making 8-bit animation cool again. Noise. Number 7. Stranger Things The Netflix hit Stranger Things introduced us to the deadly, faceless monsters called the Demogorgon. You know, those humanoids with heads that look like if a shark and a mushroom had a baby? Just imagine seeing something like that in the real world. Well, wish granted. Artist Carl Leck, who once worked at a prop house, created his interdimensional costume using primarily cardboard and gorilla tape. His masterpiece took around 35 hours and featured a mechanism using bike cables to mimic how the Demogorgon opens its mouth. Because that's the scariest thing about it, after all! I don't know about you, but if this dude goes trick-or-treating at my house, I might just kick him straight back to the upside down! Thanks, but no thanks! Number 6. Game of Thrones Remember the almighty Night King from GOT who brought Jon Snow and the gang to their knees? The true enemy won't weigh out the storm. He brings the storm. Manila might be a tropical city, but winter surely came during the 2017 Asia Pop Comic Con when cosplayer Zij Evangelista showed up dressed as the immortal master of the White Walkers. Zidge used rubber and leather for the blue-faced villain's garb, and the mask was made out of clay and filled with latex. To achieve the Night King's signature stare, he used blue LED lights inside the mask and even wore contact lenses to complete the look. But while the real Night King is a cold-hearted villain, the person behind this costume is the complete opposite. Then alone, that was, you know, inspired the young ones. So, become creative rather than do some bad vices. Number 5. Lego Lego bricks are the bane of every parent's existence. Try stepping on one of them to see what I mean! Good thing these Lego figures are six feet tall. This is my vision of the future. Ta-da! Meet graphic designer Brack Lee, the genius behind these life-sized Lego minifigures, complete with the block-like body and the weird yellow gravity hands. The idea started when his son requested a unique Halloween costume. Brack used a foam camping mat and a hot glue gun to stick all the pieces together, much like how one builds Lego bricks. And the finished products are just totally awesome! Number 4. Baby Transformers What's better than one kid dressed as a Transformer? Well, three kids dressed as these morphin' robots! You hold the key to Earth's survival. If you need more proof that dads are the coolest, thank you! Here's Mark Patriska, the creator of these adorable mini Transformers which he and his wife Taylor made for their kids. And it all started when Mark failed to get his son a costume for Halloween. The night before we went to Walmart, the whole costume department was torn to shreds. There was nothing there. All I was able to find was a Thomas the Tank Engine uh, apron, basically, and a, and a hat. <laughs> because of that, Mark promised his son he would make it up to him the year after. And lo and behold, Mini Optimus Prime and company were born. The costumes became an overnight sensation, and the kids soon attended conventions left and right, answering questions and taking pictures with fans. A UK-based costume company even bought the designs for mass marketing. Number 3. Iron Giant It's been decades since the animated science fiction film The Iron Giant was released, but the character still holds a special place in a lot of fans' hearts. 
So it didn't come as a surprise that this cosplay made a splash at the 2019 New York Comic Con. The father and son tandem of East Coast-based Helium Workshop showed off this massive iron giant suit that's so tall it had to be worn on stilts. This is huge. That's what she said. <laughs> the costume stands at around 10 feet and weighs about 60 pounds. The people behind the cosplay said it took around 500 hours and several kilos of foam and other materials to build this towering marvel. I'd say all the effort was well worth it. Number 2. Overwatch If you're a fan of this 2016 video game, the chances are you've played the character of Doomfist, the colossal brawler that flaunts an ultra-powerful cybernetic gauntlet. But just when you thought this intricate piece of high-tech weaponry couldn't possibly be duplicated in real life, in comes extreme cosplayer Jonas Zybartis, who accepted the challenge. His Doomfist comes armed with the state-of-the-art motorized gauntlet that lights up and opens up on command using a pressure sensor. Equipped with five motors, 300 handmade steel parts, and 300 LED lights, the weapon sure didn't cut any corners. Jonas even used genuine bullhorns for the shoulder armor. The power source needed to last an entire convention date, so it would mean at least eight hours of battery life with all of the LEDs and all of the motors working as hard as he can. And to make the weapon more faithful to the video game, he even electroplated the gauntlet in 24 karat gold. He sure didn't pull any punches with this one. Before we go to our number one pick, do us a solid and make sure to smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. Don't forget to choose all so you won't miss out on any of our latest life-changing, boredom-busting content. And of course, be sure to turn on notifications in your app settings. Number 1. Monster Masumi One look at the character Rachnara Arachnara from the anime series Monster Masumi will make you wonder, how could anyone replicate this giant spider lady? If costumes for characters with just two legs are already a handful, what more for this one that has eight of them? Rachnara has the body of a young woman with short lavender hair that covers the right side of her face. She has six pupilless, monochromatic red eyes and sharp pointed teeth. Her most noticeable trait, though, is the mass located at her humanoid buttocks, which is that of a giant spider adorned with a large skull design. It certainly looks complicated, but legendary cosplayer Marie-Claude Bourbonnet is the kind of chick that makes the impossible possible. The French-Canadian cosplayer herself worked on the massive fiberglass costume for her spot-on portrayal of the sadistic yet lovable character. Sprinkle it with some attitude and you have yourself an excellent cosplayer that might just be the best cure for arachnophobia. <laughs> So, which of these crazy costumes blew you away? And did we miss any other epic cosplayers on the list? Tell us about them in the comment section below. Take home any of our exclusive gear by browsing our merch shelf or clicking the link in the video description. And while you're at it, take our quiz to find out how you can earn extra cash online doing what you do best. Awesome, right? Want more cosplaying ideas for the next Comic-Con? Then don't miss our countdown of the 10 must-see R-rated anime. Till then, stay creative, Factnetics, and see you in our next video.